Hi everyone, Miss Sully here from Learn to Grow. Today is a great day for arts and crafts and we're going to make snowflake ornaments out of pipe cleaners and pom-poms. So I hope that you enjoy this project. Also, um, I'm wearing another festive top here since we are doing holiday arts, arts and crafts, so it kind of fits in with the theme. So I hope that you enjoy this episode of Learn to Grow and thanks for watching in advance. Have a great day. So here are the materials that you'll need to make the snowflake ornament. You'll need four pipe cleaners. I chose the shimmery one since we're making snowflakes and it does give that, you know, the snowflake uh, look effect. And three of them here, um, you'll leave them the way they are, but one of them you'll cut into one and a half inches in length, six of those, and then you'll end up with about two and a half inches left, which I'm going to use to secure um, the three um, strands together, which I will show you. So you might want to grab a ruler and a pencil to make the uh, coil of the um, snowflakes, scissors, six pom-poms, and some glue. So the first thing we're going to do is make three coils out of um, these pipe cleaners. So you'll just pretty much wrap it around your pencil or if you want to use a paintbrush. So this is going to be the main frame, or the frame of your snowflake. And you just pull it out, and then you have this here. So this is pretty easy to do, so just wrap it around your pencil. The same thing again. Okay, so now you've got three of these coils. So what we're going to do is we're going to interlock them in between the coils to put them together. So and if they don't it doesn't if they don't stay together that well, then you can use the extra piece of pipe cleaner to secure it. So now you have something like this. If you can see that. So next thing we'll do is we're going to attach this little um, pieces of the pipe cleaners on the tip. So what you'll do, oops, maybe pull it out a little bit here and just kind of wrap this around. I know I'll probably move down a little bit lower here. So kind of twist around. See if we can show you a closer look here. So I just twisted that little piece around each um, point, okay, of the snowflake there. So you can see that. Okay, I think I got one more. So remember, just kind of um, bending it, these, and twisting it around each um, snowflake strand. Oops. Okay, so now what we've got is this here, and even this, um, it looks fine if you want to leave it the way it is. You've got a snowflake there, but I added a little touch of the pom-poms in between, so it looks like it's got snow. So, so when you add a pom-pom, you just need to make sure you put the glue, let's see, in between here, each strand. So I, I'm using the tacky glue because, you know what, it works better for me than the um, regular school glue. Just put the pom-pom in between. So you're going to repeat it, do the same thing all the way around. And make sure you set it down to dry for at least a couple hours or more before you hang it up on your tree. You can just use a string, um, any string um, will do. If you want to um, make an ornament out of it, it actually stays um, put on the tree if you just set it um, in between the, um, the tree branches or the um, the leaves. 
the uh, Douglas fir Christmas tree, of course. So, and one more pom pom, and that is it. Okay, so that's it. So you got a snowflake that's got six, um, almost equal um, points or sides. But um, let me grab the one I already made before, so that's why it's already dried. So here's the other one, and you can pull the coil um, out so that way um, these are longer if you want to. But there you are; it's all all set. So thanks for watching, guys, and I hope that you enjoyed this one, uh, this craft project from Learn to Grow. Have a great day. Bye bye.